guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another Dollar Tree review. So this last week I hauled a few things that I was able to test. There wasn't a lot of things to test this week, so should be a short video. If you guys are not subscribed, consider subscribing and joining my family over here. I appreciate you coming back. Thanks so much for watching this review. Like I said, I always say this all the time, but these are just my opinions and how I get along with the products, but I love doing this type of video because I love testing things out. It's just so, so much fun for me. And also it kind of gets us talking about what's good, what's not. So if you feel different, let everybody know because you know, like I said, this is just my opinion. So the first thing that I wanna talk about that I really do actually love, this is the Tech Essentials. And what this is is wet and type. So this is what the package looks like. This, I found this in my electronics department at the Dollar Tree. And basically you get 25 wet wipes and you can wipe your keyboards, your iPhone, your watch, anything tech, it'll clean your screen. I really love this. Um, let me tell you. Yeah, tablets, computers, um, glass, TV, and more. So it doesn't have like a warning about like, don't use on this. So I really love it. I have been using it this week on my phone. My phone gets so dirty with just like makeup and it's been so hot. So I've just, it really gets dirty. So I've been using this a lot. I love that it's compact and it honestly really does work. I really do love it. Is it worth a dollar? That's kind of what I say on my channel because at the end we're just paying a dollar for the products. And so yes, it is 100% worth my dollar. I'd honestly say I'd pay more for it than just a dollar. So I, I would highly recommend it. Like I said, with anything, please let everybody know because you know, it's just my personal opinion. Let's talk about this power stick. Now this isn't new. They are changing the packaging and you'll kind of see, or at least I found in my Dollar Trees that a lot of these older packaging is changing and they're, they're, making a new spin on it so I'm like oh is this new and then I kind of think about it I'm like no it's not just new pa packaging but I have never tried this before and so I wanted my husband actually I've never tried it but my husband's never tried it as well and I like to get his opinion on products men's products now obviously anybody can use this so this is the power stick all day fresh this is intensity and we also have the cool blast I bought um, each scent I had and Honestly, my husband says that this one does work pretty good. He says it's a more softer deodorant, but it does hold him up. Is it his favorite? No. Um, he likes, I think it's the speed stick. He likes that better than the power stick, but it does work. And But he's never tried the all-day body refresh. So he used this. He said it was a bit strong. It is really strong. So if you're someone that does not like in your face type of scents, you would not like this because it is pretty powerful. Um, he said it was just okay. We actually like to put it, well, this whole week I've been using this as a room spray. And let me tell you, it smells amazing. I really do think it smells great for a room spray, especially if you have like stinky teenage sons or, you know, they're in sports or what have you in the bag. Just, you know how you, you know, moms can, it's, Oh, it's like, what the heck? This stuff works so good. So I've been spraying it in my son's room. He's really clean, but it just, it smells really good. So I've been using this as a room spray. I have sprayed like his stinky shoes, his like um, gym bag and stuff. And this works so good because it smells so good. It is strong, but I highly recommend it for just a room spray. So if you're looking for an inexpensive room spray, I would do this. Um, because I love it as a room spray and that's what I've been using it at, at four, at four. But he, like I said, my husband said this is okay. It's not his favorite. I will 
I want to share with you kind of what we've discovered and we really like. So this is not from the Dollar Tree. We got this at Target, but if you're looking for a good men's deodorant, he does like the speed stick. And if you guys want him to do like his top 10 favorite men's products at the Dollar Tree, because he has them, let me know and we can film that video for you guys. He's on vaca vacation this coming week and he would totally share his favorite items with you guys but this is not from the Dollar Tree we got this from Target they AOS I have found this brand at like TJ Maxx and stuff we well actually yeah I've actually used this stuff and it smells really good it is the artist board and it's just his deodorant this is what it looks like now this is a little it I think we paid like seven bucks but this smells so good you guys it's held me up it's held everybody up in my family I tend I like the women's you know deodorant but I love the men's because I feel like it does hold me up a little bit better than the woman's even like the clinical strength I feel like this one works better so I just you know want to tell you guys that this one is our favorite that we're really loving right now obviously it's not Dollar Tree and it's a little bit more expensive but it really does work and when it when we're talking deodorant I mean I'll pay up for deodorant because I don't want to be stinking or smelling you know that's one of the products I feel like you sometimes you get what you pay for and everybody's so different everybody's body type you know everything's so different so every deodorant's not gonna work the same so if you're having trouble with deodorant or just want to switch it up we I recommend actually all of us recommend this because we've been using it so just wanted to briefly talk about that the next step is just gonna be super fast these wipes love them I've hauled several different kinds of these these are so good I uh, they are thick they're great and you get 60 wipes so if you find the global beauty care um, wipes in these types of bags they're well worth a dollar I love they are they seriously are thick and since we've had this heat wave I've been using these like crazy because my face just sweaty and gross and it felt so good so highly recommend this I love it okay let's talk about three more products and these are the makeup products that I hauled this week and let's go ahead and put this down here so I this wet n wild rainbow highlighter this is in the unicorn glow and this is what the package looks like you guys now i was a little worried i was like oh my gosh because it's rainbow but i was telling you guys that i think it would look good for eyeshadow like you can highlight the inner corners you got several different colors it's just fun to work with and that's what i did today so i highlighted i don't know if the camera is going to pick it up or not but like i highlighted I used the um, pink color right here and kind of highlighted my inner corners and stuff. This one is super fun to play with. You can definitely make it a, as use it as a highlight, but I love using it like as eyeshadow. I think this one is just so fun. So highly recommend this because, you know, just because this is a highlight doesn't mean you have to, you know, have to use it for a highlight. I, I mean is a rule to make makeup I guess but you know some rules are meant to be broken and definitely this one is this can totally go for eyeshadow and highlighting and stuff like that and it, I think it really pops your eyeshadow I think it looks great so that's what I use this for so if you see it highly recommend this because it blends out great I really love it and Wet n Wild's a great brand okay so we have the mega cushion we have the highlight and then we also have the contour this one is did it tell me how this one's who's that pearl and this is what this package looks like there's a lot of um, cushion products right now foundation and stuff that we've been kind of all hauling and finding over the last few months this is what it looks like inside so it's like um, you know a little different I did use it today can you guys I'm looking at the monitor right here I think you guys can tell um, I think it's picking up I think it's really pretty I feel like it it's very subtle obviously you can build it but I really love it I think it's great actually I'll probably end up using this this whole time like I you know sometimes I try a product and I like it and then I'm like eh, I don't really grab for it but this one's really pretty I think it does give a little nice healthy glow it's not like in your face beaming highlight but I think it's very soft beautiful kind of like subtle highlight I don't know I just really love it 
And then let's talk about the contour. I use this today. I I didn't heavy contour like if I'm going to a party if I'm going woohoo. I I like to do some fancy stuff, but I you know not today. So this is what this one looks like, and um, it is Cafe Slay or something. And this is it's a dark see, and it's like um, I don't know. It's cool, and I, I used it a little bit today. Um, not like crazy, but just, I think it blends out really great as well. So I would really have, I would recommend these. Is it worth a dollar? Heck yeah. And especially if you, you know, we're all starting to travel and do things. I like to take this type, this type of stuff with me when I'm traveling or I'm staying over the night someplace because if it breaks or I lose it, I'm just out a dollar. I'm not taking my expensive palettes with me, you know, which is which is really great. And two, I mean, makeup is super expensive. It can add up. And if you can find good quality products at the Dollar Tree and they work great, I I mean, why not, right? Let's save that money. I mean, I'm all about saving money. So I would use all three again. I'm going to put them in my rotation and I really do like it. So thank you guys so much for watching. I know this was short and sweet. There was not a lot of things to test out. But I guarantee you, um, when you watch my haul on Saturday, there's going to be a lot of things to test. So next Friday, it should be pretty big. So thank you guys so much. And I will talk to you guys next time. Bye.